Hi everyone, so today's video is something really special. My girlfriend's always saying that she really loves the shoes that I make and she's always trying to steal them. So since her birthday's coming up, I figured what better to give her than a pair of custom shoes. Her favorite pair has definitely been the Murakami flower ones that I made. I mean, she was even the model for the pictures on Instagram, which if you don't follow me, go follow me. So I'm gonna make some Murakami flower themed shoes for her and hopefully she likes them as much as she liked the previous ones. So I know it's been a while since I posted uh, my last video and it's cause college low-key be kinda hard. So for those of you who are still in high school, uh, make the most out of it cause college English does not make sense at all. So here, for prepping the paint, I'm gonna use some Angelus 2 Soft. Um, what this does is that it helps the paint to become a little bit softer, and that way when you are painting on a canvas material, like the Vans, the shoe is much more flexible and uh, it prevents the paint from like cracking and stuff. The trick to it is to apply it in really thin coats. It's probably gonna take forever, it took me forever, it was like 6 layers, so but uh, as you can see right here, the results were pretty cool. I know, I know. At this point, you guys are probably sick of only watching Murakami themed stuff in my channel. But I promise you, there's more stuff coming up that is definitely not Murakami. So stay tuned. As you guys know, I like to do my stencils with pen and graphite because I don't have either the money or the time for buying and doing the actual stencils. So I mean, it works pretty well, so I'm just gonna stick to it. I mean, you know what they say, if something's not broken, then don't fix it. This time I decided to start with the um, colors instead of just like outlining it because I figured uh, it would just like make the process quicker and you know I needed to squeeze this project in between my classes and uh, my girlfriend's birthday was coming up so I really couldn't waste any time. For the colors, purple was pretty easy because, and you know, it's a darker color, so it needed like three or two coats. But then uh, the pink took me a little bit more. I think it was like four. But you know, like overall, it was pretty easy. Um, it looked pretty clean. And now I was ready to move forward to the next step. So, like I mentioned before, um, I decided to outline last. Because since you already have all those layers of paint, you only need to go over the outline once. And trust me, it saves you a lot of time. I just wanted to apologize because I am aware that my head gets in the way in some takes. Because you know, my setup is pretty much just a bunch of cardboard boxes and a tripod that holds the phone vertically. So I guess until I start making big money out of this, you're probably gonna have to deal with uh, my redhead getting on the way. So, sorry. You're gonna see in a second that I'm using a white marker to go over the outline once again. And that's just to like make the lines a little bit crispier. Look, there it is. I don't know, it just helps like the overall result.
the plan was to put like the audio of me peeling off the tape because it's really satisfying but I was listening to uh, very loud music so um, sorry I guess now for the shoes, I'm using just regular Angelus acrylic finisher. Um, I know it's kind of glossy, but I like the way it looks, and that's what I used for the other vans. Uh, I do have others, but I feel like the glossy one works really well with like the overall team. As you know, I like to do the lace tips of my shoes. I feel like it really gives like a very personal touch. And I feel like people often overlook how nice a uh, detail, like a small detail like this can give to the shoe. And I mean, I don't know, I feel like it's kind of like my signature thing. I find it really interesting. It's kind of hard to do though, cause like the thing's really tiny. But um, you know, I feel like it really adds up to the overall design and the final result of the shoes. That's the last step of the process, so now enjoy the reveal! day remaining we're finally done with the project so now we just gotta wrap it up and hope that she likes it I belong, I belong. <laughs> the wrapping is really cute it's fine you can tear the paper you can break it it's fine <laughs> you can just walk okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. I need to get rid of this game. This is my junior year. You want school photo? Are these shoes? Are these shoes? Are these? Could these be custom house shoes? What? No way. No way. Those are 